Uncounté. 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 Let's count. We're going to count from 11 to 20. Last time we counted from 1 to 10. 11 to 20. It's already on the board for it. So what do we have? We have 11. 11. 12. 12. 13. 13. 14. 14. 15. 15. 16. 16. 17. 17. 18. 18. 19. 19. 20. 20. We're going to separate the sounds. 11. 11. 12. 12. 13. 13. 13. 13. 14. 14. Z quatorze quinze 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 seize z seize dix-sept de i s e t dix-sept dix-sept dix-huit de i z u t dix-huit Dix-neuf, d, i, i, d, i, z, n, e, f, dix-neuf, vingt, v, e, vingt. Huh? That's counting to twenty. So you're gonna have to practice that. You practice of counting. Now, things that can help you master the language is it's good to learn how to count. The first thing I learned. In Spanish and English was counting. It kind of helped. It's like you already get used to the pronunciation at some level, right? Even in counting. Now, the other thing, it's good. Remember I told you you can't speak a language if you don't expose yourself to the language. Like, go to the Haitian community. You need a couple of Haitian friends so you can practice, right? So you can practice the language. Now, the other thing you will need is songs. One way I learned how to speak English was through English songs and then singing them. As I'm singing them, my pronunciation was getting better. I don't know why, I don't know how, but it's like as I was singing, my pronunciation was getting better. Now, here's what I want you to do. Homework already for you. Homework, homework. The first slide of lesson three, all the Creole words there, you're going to go research them and see what they mean. Right? Research them and then see what they mean in English. Now the other thing you're gonna do, let's do it right now. In this, the numbers here, the vowels with two signs, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna underline the vowels with two signs. What are the vowels with two signs in this? We already underlined them here for you. So it's easy, right? Oh, that's one of them. Two signs. Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, ooh. What else do we have? Vowel, eh, eh. Vowels with two signs. One letter but with two signs. What's the next one? Yui, 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 yui. That's the next one. What else we have? This one, eh, again. All right, it was easy. Easy peasy, right? Very easy for you. Now, we're gonna move to a conversation. And again, what matters is you trying to pronounce. All right, that's what matters. Don't worry too much. Don't worry too much. We'll get there. You will see little by little. Chical pa chical. That's how we say it in Creole. Little by little. Chical pa chical. You will learn. You will see yourself start pronouncing um, correctly. You start knowing how to read. We'll get to that. Because if you follow this class, if you follow everything I tell you, by the end of this class, you will be able to write. You will be able to read. Speaking might take a little more time, but you should be able to start doing that as well. All right, let's move on to the conversation.